Hi everyone, this is Mohammed Mehboob. Here is a quick video explaining how we can use um, Dynamo to visualize the clashes within the Revit environment using the report generated by Revit um, interface check. So what I have on the screen um, is a Revit model where the clashes have been made for purpose for this exercise so as we can see there are a number of clashes I would use the uh, rabbit interface check and for this exercise let me check all the categories It will generate a series of clashes within the model which then can be exported to the HTML format by using a custom definition I have to uh, basically get the file path where the HTML report has been saved. It will then list me all the uh, the clashes found within the uh, the report. I need to create the uh, list to make sure there are no null values. I need to flatten and uh, clean the list and using the uh, set parameter value by name I will use the comments parameter for now we can create a custom uh, shade parameter which the, then can be easily scheduled and uh, you know you can keep track of the uh, the number of clashes found on multiple uh, Revit models and I will add a filter to this parameter name so for now as we can see that when I select the uh, the element I basically don't um, I basically have written here not found so we, if I select any other pipe doctor cable tray I should see the same value let's schedule the uh, monthly category and uh, and we can see that it's all uh, not found And now when we uh, run the definition, uh, wherever there are clashes uh, found within the HTML report, it would then be added. And to visualize this, I would apply the uh, template. I created a separate template for coordination view. Uh, that is for the 3D. And then I go to the filters, add a custom filter. Clash found. I need to make sure that I check all the categories um, um, that basically I need for maybe walls, floors, cable trays, and then I can filter the comments parameter and make sure that wherever there are clashes found, I can. Uh, uh, basically set that filter value I can uh, override the color here
So now this way I can easily visualize the clashes within the model. The same way if I go for the plan view, I should be uh, able to do the same with the coordination template. Then I just need to make sure that um, you know every every individual view I have this custom made template where I set this uh, uh, parameter value. Uh, as predefined so it will basically highlight all the, uh, the information for me it's the same thing if I go to a section view I should be able to visualize the same since I have uh, added data as a parameter For now, I'll just pick one color. So as we can see that uh, the ones which are highlighted are the ones which um, has the clashes. Let's say if I have sold this clash now, then basically what I can um, do is uh, clear the value, uh, which then uh, automatically remove the uh, the coloring from here. So this is it for now. I hope you find this education entertaining. Thank you for watching.